The News Edge at 6 starts now with disturbing new video in the suitcase murder trial. Were you guys drinking and it got out of hand and no. it got physical? No. Or is Sunday was one of the better days that we have had in quite some time. We go inside the interrogation room with Sarah Boone. She's accused of killing her boyfriend by zipping him inside a suitcase. Have you ever zipped him up in a suitcase prior? No. It happened three years ago. She claims the two were playing a game of hide and seek. Last time we talked to you, you said that you put him in the suitcase. I flipped him over, and that's where it was. But deputies say she left him in there until he died. So pushing up on a suitcase saying, Sarah, 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 I can't, I can't breathe. George has done that in the past before, too, where it's just like he thinks that he's woe is me kind of thing. Take a look at these pictures. They come from video found on Boone's cell phone. Investigators say these are the moments when George Torres Jr. was zipped up into the suitcase and died. Good evening and welcome. I'm Luann Sorrell. And I'm John Brown. Boone's trial is set to begin two weeks from today. Fox 35 Stephanie Buffamonte joins us in studio tonight. And Stephanie, you look through hours of evidence today and you have more chilling videos. But before we show them to you, we want to warn you that some of these may be disturbing. That is right. Some of the videos are just really hard to look at. So before we show you, take a moment, make sure you're ready. Prosecutors say Sarah Boone was the one filming her boyfriend trapped in the suitcase where he would later die. In the video, you can hear her taunting him as he was pleading to get out. Sarah. That's my name. Don't wear it up. Prosecutors say George Torres is zipped shut inside the suitcase and that Sarah Boone was the one recording as he was desperately pleading for her to let him out. Boone taunts her then boyfriend, even laughs as she records him. You can see the bag moving. <laughs> Sarah. <laughs> you. Sarah. <laughs> Stupid. Boone told investigators she put Torres in the suitcase during a game of hide and seek. This happened back in February 2020. She's now charged with second degree murder. According to investigators, she claimed she was drinking wine and went upstairs to sleep during the game while Torres was still in the suitcase. Sarah, I f you. Please, Sarah. Yeah. You should probably shut the f up. Sarah. According to court documents, she recorded the video after 11 at night. Boone called police at 1 in the afternoon the next day. She told deputies she found him dead after she woke up. He thought it would be funny to be put in the suitcase, so I was like, okay, well, I'm going to joke with you, and I'll zip you up and make him, you know, squirm a little bit, whatever it is. But then I fell asleep, so I came downstairs, funny, and I was like, oh, he's in the suitcase still. That's when I found him and I took him out. Susan Constantine, a body language expert who has worked on high profile cases, says this part of the video stuck out to her. They're going to think I killed him. She says, oh my God, they're going to think I killed him. First of all, no one asked her that question. She's being interviewed. She's kind of frantic. And then she just blurts it out. <laughs> it's just, it's interesting subconsciously what is on her mind. Boone was supposed to be in court today for a pre-trial hearing that was pushed from today to next week. Her trial begins on July 24th. In the studio, Stephanie Buffmonte, Fox 35 News. Thanks, Stephanie. And over on our YouTube page, we have the full video from the state attorney's office. Just search Fox 35 Orlando on YouTube. We also have the 911 call and more video from this case posted on our website. Just go to Fox35Orlando.com.